The historical territory now called Artsakh has been part of Armenia since ancient times. It was part of the Kingdom of Wan from the invasions of Sarduri II. At that time, it was named after Urtekh. Then Artsakh continued to be part of Greater Armenia during the times of the Yervanduni dynasty, Artashesian dynasty, Arshakuni dynasty, and later, already during the rule of Bagratuni and Zakarian. During the years of the First Republic of Armenia, Artsakh continued to be part of Armenia. In the period from May 1918 to April 1920, the armed units of Azerbaijan, supported by Turkey, carried out violence and massacres against the Armenian population. However, with the direct intervention of Joseph Stalin, a decision was made to include Nagorno-Karabakh as part of Soviet Azerbaijan and to establish an autonomous region in that territory. In May 1991, the beginning of the Artsakh War was announced. Unable to resist the decisive actions of the Armenian forces, the enemy asked for a ceasefire, which was signed on May 12, 1994. However, after after the signing of the ceasefire, provocative actions by Azerbaijan continued and became regular. By not reaching an agreement in the negotiation process and violating the ceasefire in the early morning of September 27, 2020, Azerbaijan started active shelling along the entire line of contact. The hostilities ended on November 10, with a joint statement by Armenia, Azerbaijan and Russia, as a result of which the Artsakh Republic lost most of its territories and the status of Artsakh remained unclear. Armenian Apostolic Medieval Monastery Complex, situated in the Divan Artsakh, left side to the river Tartar. Historically, it used to be the spiritual prelacy of Big Fang province. It was also known as Hutavang, Monastery on the Hill. For the first time in a while, the monastery is mentioned in some bibliographic resources. According to a legend, the monastery was founded by State Tadi, a disciple of Tadeus the Apostle in the first century. In July 2007, the grave of State Dadi was discovered under the holy altar of the main church. In 1145, the monastery was destroyed by Seljuks, but it was rebuilt in 1170. There are many Hajkars saved from those times and some of them stand as a memory of Hatterk noble dynasty. Tigranagird is located in the southeast of the Martagird region of the Artsakh Republic, on the right bank of the Khachen River. It was built in the 1st century BC by the Armenian king Tigran the Great. The historians of 7th century Sebos and Movses Karangatvatsi mentioned about Artsakh's Tigranagird. It existed as a settlement until the late Middle Ages and was in the territory of Khachan. During the Soviet period, Tigranagert was located in the Agdam region. The exact location of Tigranagert was discovered in 2005 during archaeological excavations. In 2006 began excavations in Artsakh's Tigranagert. One of the most important finds of the excavation is the Armenian inscription. Holy Savior Cathedral is an Armenian Apostolic Cathedral in Shushi, Artsakh. It was built in 1868 to 1887 by the local residents. The architect was Simon Terhakopian. It is considered to be the second most important spiritual center in Artsakh, after the monastery of Khanzasar. The architectural complex consists of a church and a bell tower. The inscription of the belfry testifies that it had been built 10 years earlier than the church itself. Usually the belfry is built after the construction of the church. Shushi Castle is Armenian castle settlement from Middle Ages. It is located in Artsakh Republic in Shushi city. 
Shushi Castle belongs to Malik Shah Nazarian, who was the ruler of Varanda. The castle is mentioned in different ways, Karagaluk, Kar, and etc. It is often called Shushi Castle because people from neighbor Shushi hid there during the attacks. There is an opinion that the basis of Shushi Fort is fence and buildings was named by Avan Harapet, who was the main commander of Armenian detachment in 1724. But there is another opinion that the castle was built earlier and in 1720s Avan Harapet rebuilt it. St. John the Baptist Church, commonly known as Ganacham, is an Armenian apostolic church located in the Republic of Artsakh Shushi. Ganacham means green chapel in Armenian, as there was a time when the church domes were painted green. Ganacham has unique architectural innovations. Over the entrance to the chapel, there is an Armenian inscription. Shushi Carpet Museum was opened in 2013 in Shushi's Art Center. It includes more than 250 carpets made from the end of 17th century to the beginning of 19th century, which present the features of carpet making art. The purpose of building the museum was to protect Artsakh traditional carpet from forgetfulness and from destruction by Azerbaijan. There are exhibits which have life more than hundreds of years. The author of the initiative is Vartan Asadrian, who presented that Turkish wanted to destroy Armenian manuscript in carpet art and actual ideology of pan-Turkism on Armenians. Turkish collected Armenian carpets from Armenian villages and exchanged with new ones or with another products. Now the museum's permanent exhibition includes 120 carpets from 300. The Shushi Carpet Museum is an invaluable institution that testifies about Artsakh's rich traditions of carpet making, which is a great opportunity to study the famous carpet making of Artsakh. Ohtadrneri Bank Monastery with multiple doors is a monastery located in Hadrut Artsakh. It is located 3.5 km far from village Mohrenes mountainside of Yugosen. The monastery, similar to many other Armenian cathedrals built in the 7th century, is unique and includes some architectural elements of all Christian worship. The monastery is fully designed by crude and unrefined stones. There are no lithographic inscriptions from those ages, only two hachkars. One of them is located in deep altar of the church, below the window, and the second one is located in the churchyard, inside of the ruined chapel. The first hachkar is very simple, designed by the 10th to 12th century style. The age of the cross and with balls. There are grapevines on wings of the cross. The hachkar is known as the oldest one in Artsakh, it was built 47 years earlier than Hazar Khachkar Amaras Waili. Guchavank is a monastic complex located 1.8 km northwest of Toh village in the Hadrut region of the Republic of Artsakh. Construction began in 1241 and was completed in 1248. In the 15th century, Guchavank also became a cultural center and had a penthouse. The monument of Kuchavank is one of the famous monuments of centuries old Armenian architecture with its high architectural features. The stone masons of Artsakh are not confined to their architectural environment. They took the newer and more beautiful from other Armenian states, in harmony with the magnificent nature, with the proportion of the different parts of the complex, with the restrained shapes of the facade decoration. It is unique.